since the dawn of time, when man first crawled out of the primordial slime and sat down to watch television, legends have been told to explain natural phenomena. One of the most gripping of these is tonight's story, the sad tale of why underpants ride up. <laughs> long, long ago, there was a time when man had not yet domesticated underpants and they used to fly around the southern skies, pulling and darting in and out of the trees, catching every little breeze and having a really good time. The freedom of these delightful creatures fascinated man, as did their beautiful colours and markings. Hey look, there's a pair of Scarlet Billy Jockets. <laughs> Like that one's got hot stuff written on the crotch. Oh, like <laughs> but alas, man is by his very nature a savage creature who envied the underpants freedom. But anyway, he needed something to stop his hair from getting caught in the zipper. Oh. So he set a trap by putting the underpants' favourite seed on the clothesline and waited. And next morning, there it was. A hoist full of thick underpants. Everyone was really happy and looked for a pair his right size. But later on, when they were celebrating their victory... Uh, crikey! Hey, uh, what's going on? Uh, she's come on there. They don't have cat in here. Yes, the underpants were having their revenge. Because every night, just about sunset, they'd try to fly back to their nest. And it hurt like anything. <laughs> And sort of pull up, you know, pull up, and then really cut them, you know, round about, you know, down there. You know, you know. 